Hey, Tony here. Today I'm going to be going to Barnes & Noble for the Barnes & Noble Criterion Sale. So I thought I would just take you along with me, let you see what I'm going to pick up. Um, so let's see how it goes. So the Barnes & Noble closest to me, um, they do not have a um, Blu-ray movie section. All they have are the books and the Funko Pops. So I had to go an hour out of the way to go to a location that actually has a physical media department. And so um, that's the reason why I'm choosing to go hand pick the items that I want to get. I just want to make sure that the items are in stock and that I can actually see what the actual item looks like. I like to actually look at the items and kind of browse to see what I want. And there may be something that I haven't seen online yet that might catch my eye um, and I do like to spend the time inside the department just to look at what I want to buy. Most of the time I do go to blu-ray.com to see um, to watch the trailers for the releases and also to uh, read the reviews that have been posted and also I do like to talk to other people in the community to see what their recommendations are. Okay, I just left Barnes & Noble. Um, I was able to find five more items, plus all the titles that I picked up. So, I got this big old bag here full. And this big old bag full. So when I get home, I'll take them out and we'll show you what all I picked up. So I finally made it back home and I'm going to go ahead and show you what I picked up. I did pick up 12 items that I had pre-ordered that I picked up at the store and I also um, located eight more titles that I wanted that I purchased so I thought I'd go ahead and just show you what I got first up and I'm not going to go into any detail about these um, other than just to know that these are all from recommendations and from my research on um, blu-ray.com and some various um, YouTube channels so first up I got Rashomon I've heard a lot of good things about this one I really like that. Got a lot of special features. I've got Come and See. A lot of recommendations for this particular movie. Um, Wildlife. The Great Escape. So I've heard about this movie many, many times. I do remember um, seeing this a long time ago. Um, but I do not remember it. I was, I was very young at the time, so I'm looking forward to checking this one out. Until the End of the World. Lady Vanishes. House. Heard a lot of great things about this one. This may be the first one that I watch. Destry Rides Again. Um, Detour. Now this is one that I've been waiting to get. Um, David over at Cartoon Fortress has really um, been pushing me toward getting this one, so I finally picked it up. The 400 Blows. War of the Worlds. And The Three Fantastic Journeys by Karel Zaman. Um, this does have the pop-up packaging, which um, I think is a really great idea. Can't wait, to see, can't wait to see what that one looks like. I'll probably go ahead and search that one out just so I can see someone unbox it. Now, while I was in the store, I was able to browse around and found a lot of other titles that I wanted. I um, finally picked up Showboat. Paris, Texas, which is another recommendation from David over at Cartoon Fortress. Really look, I'm really looking forward to seeing this one. Um, he also recommended um, The Cameraman. Um, this right here is a Buster Keaton film. I do have um, some of the, his um, Buster Keaton collections in my, um, in my collection, so I am very happy to add that one to it. And then David also recommended Slacker. So I'm um, really um, looking forward to this one. So this is, so the rest of these I'm going to show you are the little, um, are the digipack um, type packaging, I guess. 
Um, I got Seven Samurai. Always heard great things about this one, just never have picked it up. So I finally grabbed it. Um, I got Roma. Breaking the Waves. And lastly, I got Repo Man. So these right here, I'm really happy to have these added to my collection. There are a few more titles that, I, um, that I'm looking for. I'm still looking for The Fugitive Kind and Failsafe. Those are two titles that I, I hopefully will be able to um, have shipped to me. And I did go ahead and order um, The Grand Budapest Hotel and Moonrise Kingdom. And then I've got Marriage Story and the Bruce Lee collection um, coming already. I had already pre-ordered those. So those should be um, shipped and I can't wait to get those in. As soon as I do, um, I will probably just post another video to show you those. But I'm very happy with this Criterion sale. I'm glad that I was able to get all the titles that I want. Well, most of the titles that I wanted. It is, it's, it's bad that I have to drive so long to go browse for these. Um, just the distance to have to go to it. But I really do um, enjoy going and looking through the department. There's so many titles out there that it really helps me to just be able to browse and look at them on the shelf. They did not have very much on the shelf at this particular store. Um, probably because most of these titles I had already um, pre-ordered and they had it at the register for me. Um, but this was a great deal and I'm very happy to have it. I do look forward to seeing what all you um, were able to get during this Criterion sale. Um, please leave me a comment below. Let me know what you picked up, what you might have um, ordered, and maybe even give me some recommendations of what you think I should check out first. I really do enjoy reading your comments and I really do enjoy this community. Also, if you would like to, you can find me over on Letterboxd. Um, my username is Toy Collector. I do like interacting with people and I do like seeing what other people have been watching. And feel free to check me out. Um, check out my Criterion list and you can see what I've watched so far from my Criterion um, pickups. But thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. If you like what you saw here today, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I really appreciate it if you would subscribe. Now, if you do subscribe, please remember to um, hit that notification bell to, so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me in my social media accounts, I'm on Facebook, Twitter, and on Instagram. So you can find me there, and we will see you next time.